I'm meteorologist Bobby J. We're going to be getting a little bit toastier in the forecast for the next couple of days. So hot that we'll likely see some new record highs uh, being broken here today and maybe into tomorrow. We're going to be really close tomorrow. And then after that, a nice swing in temperatures. We are getting into those fall temperatures, a huge drop compared to where we are at for the next couple of days and what we're expecting for this weekend. Now, uh, some haze expected next couple of days. Of course, the Cedar Creek fire to our north, even some lower air quality up into Douglas County. Uh, we see rain moving in. This is fantastic news uh, for the ongoing fires across the northwest, something we desperately need of course, helping our drought conditions as well. And we see that moving in late Friday through Saturday. That is the better chance for rain. We might even uh, continue this into next week. Uh, some of the latest guidance has started to dry us out into the start of next week, but we still have several days until uh, we get into that. So we will likely see some additional changes over the next couple of days looking into next week. For the coastline today, they're dealing with some patchy fog in the morning hours, mostly sunny this afternoon. Brookings getting into some lower 70s. The rest of the coast sitting in those 60s. Likely some patchy fog here again for tonight. Again, air quality alert goes through Friday uh, for Douglas County. Some lower air quality at times. High is going to be into those mid 80s again. The record high for Medford is 83, so likely going to beat that record. And again, that continues east of the Cascades as well, nearing that record heat with upper 70s and low 80s. Morning lows dropping into the 30s. Lots of sunshine out there for today. A little bit of a haze for the next couple of days. Uh, you do see the rain chances increasing late Friday night in through Saturday. And look at the difference in temperatures going from 80s to 50s and lower 60s this weekend. Lower 60s continues into the start of next week and those morning lows dropping to the lower 40s we might even get into the 30s depending on how quickly this um rain clears out. If it sticks around throughout Saturday night and early Sunday, we might not make it to 30, but we're going 44 now. Still a little bit chillier. Now the Klamath Basin will be dipping into the 20s. We're going to watch those snow levels dropping. Still higher elevation snow expected. Rain for the Klamath Basin. Showers on Saturday. Also windier conditions, but yes, the next couple of days record heat as well as in Northern California, if not tying or beating those record highs. But dropping into the 50s this weekend. Morning lows into the 30s. The coastline will see some mid and upper 60s and yes, even some 70s. Patchy fog next few days. Rain moves in late Friday and pretty much goes into next week. Again, that is still questionable for now.